The fitness world mourns the loss of a beloved icon, Richard Simmons, who passed away on Saturday, July 13, just one day after celebrating his 76th birthday. The news of his passing, believed to be from natural causes pending toxicology reports, broke on Monday via TMZ. It was revealed that Simmons had suffered a fall in his home the night before his death. The eccentric trainer and television personality, known for his vibrant energy and heartfelt dedication to helping others, experienced a dizzy spell before the fall, which occurred in his bathroom. Despite the urging of his housekeeper to seek medical attention, Simmons chose to wait, not wanting to spend his birthday in the hospital. He expressed his intention to see a doctor on Saturday, but tragically, he was found on the floor next to his bed the following morning. Simmons' death comes at a time when he was actively working on an exciting new project, a Broadway musical about his life. In his final interview, released posthumously by People, he shared his enthusiasm for the show, revealing he had written 14 songs and was collaborating with Patrick Leonard. The whole show is about my life, from selling prayer lines in New Orleans at a candy store when I was a kid, to when I decided to retire, he told the outlet. In a poignant twist, Simmons touched on the subject of death during this interview, reading from an audio recording he had made that week. How do you deal with loss? It takes a toll on your heart. Some shed many tears, others stare at the sky. It's so hard to say goodbye, he said. Here is what I know when it's time for us to go. Beautiful angels will greet us with a smile and a hello. Just hours before his passing, Simmons shared what would be his final Facebook post, a glamorous photo from an old photo shoot, adorned with makeup and eye gems, captioned with a fitting farewell. Hello, gorgeous. Please don't rain on my parade. Richard Simmons' social media pages continue to be active, managed by his family and staff, who are sharing updates and memories. His brother Lenny posted a touching tribute, urging fans to remember Simmons for the joy and love he brought into people's lives. He truly cared about people. He called, wrote, and emailed thousands of people throughout his career to offer help. So don't be sad. Celebrate his life. He was very excited about all of the upcoming ventures he was working on. We are in shock. Please respect the family at this difficult time, Lenny concluded. As fans and loved ones reflect on Richard Simmons' remarkable life, they celebrate the genuine joy and compassion he spread throughout his career. His legacy of kindness, dedication, and exuberance will continue to inspire and uplift people for years to come. Sad news came Saturday, July 13, that beloved fitness guru Richard Simmons passed away the day after his 76th birthday. While his death is believed to be from natural causes, pending toxicology reports, news came on Monday from TMZ's that he suffered from a fall the night before. The eccentric trainer and TV personality turned 76 on Friday, July 12. Thames reports that he fell that evening in a bathroom in his home. According to law enforcement sources, his housekeeper helped him up and tried to convince him to seek medical attention, but he chose not to. Simmons reportedly felt dizzy before his fall and said he would maybe go to the doctor on Saturday. When he said he didn't want to go on his birthday, she helped him back in bed. The next morning, she found him on the floor next to the bed. His passing comes after recent news that he was working on a Broadway musical about his life. He shared his excitement on Facebook and with P.O.P.L.E. in his final interview, which was released on Monday. He told the outlet he had written 14 songs for the show and was working with Patrick Leonard. I write the lyrics and he writes the music. The whole show is about my life. From selling prayer lines in New Orleans at a candy store when I was a kid, to when I decided to retire, he told the outlet. Interestingly enough, the fitness guru also made mention of death in the interview. He read the audio he had just recorded that week. How do you deal with loss? It takes a toll on your heart. Some shed many tears. Others stare at the sky. It's so hard to say goodbye, he said. Here is what I know when it's time for us to go. Beautiful angels will greet us with a smile and a hello. Hours before his death, Simmons shared his last Facebook post, an old photo shoot of himself looking beautiful with makeup and eye gems. Hello, gorgeous. Please don't rain on my parade, he wrote. 
His page is still active, with family and members of the staff sharing information. Richard's brother Lenny shared a touching post writing, I don't want people to be sad about my brother. I want them to remember him for the genuine joy and love he brought to people's lives. He truly cared about people. He called, wrote, and emailed thousands of people throughout his career to offer help. So don't be sad. Celebrate his life. He was very excited about all of the upcoming ventures he was working on. We are in shock. Please respect the family at this difficult time, he concluded.